As one of the world's largest manufacturers of construction equipment, Volvo has a clear responsibility for reducing the environmental impact of its products. At Volvo Construction Equipment, technological development has always taken place with a view to the environment. Our most important task during the coming years is to create even more environmentally friendly manufacturing processes and products. Our goal is to maximize productivity and efficiency and to minimize our environmental impact. To achieve this goal, we strive for a holistic view, continuous improvement, technical development and efficient resource utilization. After all, our business is not just about caring for our customers, it's about taking care of our world as well. Here are some very useful suggestions as to how you can reduce your environmental impact and save money. It's important to always carry out scheduled service and maintenance on the machines. Use specified oils and original spare parts. Always plan your operation. Place the excavator so that a minimum slewing angle is needed. Increase slewing, cost fuel and time. Check the attachments of the machine because worn out teeth or damaged side cutters will decrease the fuel efficiency of the machine and this will improve penetration, which improves better cycle times and reduces fuel consumption. Volvo offers a variety of different options for different applications. Self-sharpening teeth are made specifically for the Volvo excavator. When filling the bucket, always aim to achieve high fill factors in order to work more efficiently. As higher engine RPM increases fuel consumption, try to avoid it if it's not necessary. You can achieve a more precise handling with lower RPMs. Echo mode will improve fuel efficiency without loss of performance. Don't leave the engine running when not in use. All these measures will lower the fuel consumption and thereby reduce the environmental impact and save money. Be conscious of the environment when performing service and maintenance. When draining, oils and liquids should always be collected in suitable containers to avoid spills. Oil and other fluids are harmful to the environment and if disposed of carelessly, they will cause damage. Used filters should be drained of all liquid before they're discarded as waste. Used batteries should be handled as waste harmful to the environment. Consumables like rags, gloves and bottles may also be contaminated with oils and fluids. They too should be regarded as waste harmful to the environment. In common for all harmful waste, it should be handed over to a treatment and disposal company approved by the authorities.